You belong to the house of El, Kara. A house of hope. In my years fighting crime, I've learned one truth. That every villain is the hero of his own story. Superman was no exception. The Joker drugged him, tricked him into killing his pregnant wife Lois, and made him trigger the bomb that nuked Metropolis. So when Superman killed the Joker, I understood why. We all did. But once that line was crossed, there was no going back. He gave himself and the Justice League a new mandate. Stop all crime before it happened, by any means necessary. But he couldn't see his good intentions were leading him down a path of tyranny and evil. That's how our greatest hero became our greatest threat. So what if Superman's pulling criminals out of Arkham? They're the worst of the worst. He's going to kill them, Damien. Sounds like justice to me. Killing people isn't justice. Superman can't see that. He's grieving. He needs time to heal. Yeah, and what if it had been Gotham? If Joker had killed me, your own son? Thought he'd say that. Not responding, we're being taken to the back cave. Prepare to eject. Shot cyborg. I won't hurt you unless I have to. You're gonna have to. My friends were in Metropolis, Batman. Starfire, Beast Boy, gone. We do this. That never happens again. You're right to be angry, but it's not a blank check. And the Justice League isn't a death squad. You don't see it yet, but Superman's wrong. Your glider skills need work. Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Let's go. So you won't kill, but you're fine with traumatic brain injuries. Secure the loading docks. Here to help, Bruce? Yes, to keep you and Clark from making a terrible mistake. None of us wanted this, but the Joker forced our hand. Metropolis changed the world. Now we have to change with it. Not like this. 